Uh, listen, I'm instituting some changes here, and I've been needing you to assist me. I've chosen you, Kerry, because I think you've got the right attitude. You could have quite a future if you set your mind to it. Hmm? Yes. Now, look, what I want you to do is very important. Have you ever seen or studied the inside of a clock? All the components are reliant on the others, but some play a bigger role and some are smaller. But the mechanism does not function unless all the parts are working. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes. Good. Our job is to make sure all the parts that go to make up balls are performing to the best of their ability. Right. You're going to have to keep your wits about you, though. Sometimes people resent change. So, uh, you're going to have to put aside some of your friendships, Dandy, I'm afraid, and um, fill these forms in as accurately as you can. Okay? Any questions? Can I go back to the office later? More, more, right. One of the first laws of industry reduced the amount of unnecessary contact between employees. And the girls won't mind? Oh, no. Well, you'll find they'll appreciate the lack of distraction. Not after a while. <laughs> Now, this should overcome your delay problems in dispatch, Mr. Ball. Save you a bit of effort. Hey, Kevin. If you say so, Mr. Ball. Stuff like that is not trapped. It was really good. And so, they put me Right. Out. I've staggered the lunch hours at three separate shifts, 12, 12, 30, and 1, and removed a couple of tables. But there's a tendency when you have a large group of people for conversation to eat into production time. Oh. Uh, these changes, of course, are very minor. Um, I want to spend the next few days going over the financial side of your business. Huh? Um. Kerry. Is that as fast as you can do it? I don't know, I never thought about it. Please do it again? Oh, no, Kerry. Look, you have to. It says so right here. Now we're all set for the dinner dance. Everyone knows what's expected of him. Yeah, right, good. Right. Oh, you got a new executive. You right, Kerry? Um, would you mind starting work so I can find what you're doing? Come on. 